All right, so the Baroque period um, pipe organ and the current, uh, wouldn't have this thing down here. It's called a blower. Um, what you would have had is someone pumping air manually, just like, a, you know, like a turkey baster sort of thing. Um, so, but here we have a, a, a blower and it puts air into this area right here. And then it goes through a pipe into the chest. And so when you're playing the organ, when you pull a stop, when you pull a stop nap, knob, it'll activate the chest and say, and I start allowing air to those pipes. Then when you press down a certain note on the keyboard, the air will go through the pipe that goes with that note. And that's how it will sound. When you, as long as you hold down the note, air, and as long as the organ is getting air, uh, air will go through the pipe and the pipe will sound. When you stop pressing on the pipe, or no, when you stop pressing on the key, or if the air on the instrument stops working, which sometimes happens, then the, the note will stop. But if you hold it down and if there's air still going, then you can keep playing until Jesus comes back. Um, the different pipes are made out of different things. Some of them are made out of wood, some of them are made out of metal, and that changes how the sound, it changes the sound of the pipe. So a wood, uh, a wood pipe will sound more like a flute or just like a regular um, pipe, like a pipe organ sound. The reed pipe, um, it would be a, it's a metal pipe and it has like a, a reed on the inside, just like, um, uh, like a uh, clarinet or oboe, and that reed vibrates and that changes how the, the pipe sounds. And so you have all these combinations and you choose the combinations as well as um, the keys that you're playing. And that's that's how you can get different sounds on a pipe organ. So this is in a Baroque, in the Baroque period, you would have had someone pumping and then um, the organ for someone person playing at the organ. So in order to practice, you have to have someone there. Now, these days, obviously we have electricity and so we don't need um, a blower, or we, we don't need someone to do this, we have a blower. Um, and if now, the chain, there's been changes in how pipe organs are built. So the console here, if you look at St. John's, the console where you play the keyboard is not exactly attached to the, to the pipe organ. Um, because it has electricity, we have like electronics to connect the two. But here it has to be directly connected. And some people have pipe organs in their house, like me. Yay, I have a pipe organ in my house. It doesn't work yet. I'm told that it's supposed to work by this the end of next week. We will see how that works. Um, here's my old cat, Shelly. She passed away. But um, she used to like running around on the instrument. And my cat, Abby, likes to run and sit on top of the console and get attention. All right, so um, we will have a chance to go visit the pipe organ at St. John's, as well as look at the harpsichord that is there.